Hey guys, it's Tanya and welcome back to my channel. It's time for another rip review. Before we get into it, go ahead and head over to my Instagram. Go ahead and follow me. Um, yeah, so this is another sleek lay wig. So the last wig I reviewed for my comeback wig review was Apolia by Altrey Sleek Lay Line. And now I am reviewing Adelaide. I got Adelaide in different color. Apolia was in a 1B. I decided to go out on the limb and get Adelaide in a chocolate frost. I think that would look really nice in this style. Very nice, like loose wand curl style. Sorry if you hear my son in the background. That's just gonna be like a thing for our videos from now on. He's older, he's smarter, and he's active now. Anyways, I'm not going to go over the cap construction because it's literally the same exact cap construction. It's the, the feature, of course, is the sleek lay part. This one seems a little more puffier than the last one. I will say that. Um, but, you know, we're going we're gonna to just go with it. Of course, I'm going to have to tint the lace. There are baby hairs. I don't know. If, yeah, they say this is H HD lace, so it's real. It's a really nice soft lace. It's not HD though, but it's a really nice soft Swiss. Knots look really good, of course. Like right in the five by five perimeter of the the, the the hairline. It actually looks okay on the side, but it's probably gonna be look thicker once I have it on. I'm gonna throw her on really fast so y'all can see how she looks before I do my customizations. This is how she looks on before I do anything to her. She is a 30 inch wig. I'm 5'2", so she comes past my waistline, right to my butt with the curls. I cannot wait. I'm probably just definitely going to brush out these curls or finger comb them out. So, and I am, even though it's supposed to be a sleek leg, it is kind of puffy, like I said. So I will have to go in with my flat iron, or my cock comb. I'm not going to show you guys how I install this wig. This wig review, if you want to see how I install my T-part lace wigs, please go visit my last wig review for Apolia. That uh, will be linked down below. I'm going to go ahead and install her, get pretty, and come back and give you my thoughts. Okay, guys, I'm back. This is, like, several days later, mind you. I just couldn't, like, uh, get a chance to record my uh and, you know i didn't i wasn't going to record an installation but i also didn't get a chance to just record my thoughts on the wig until now so i finally have a chance to record my thoughts on this wig altre adelaide part of the sleek lay hairline or sleek lay line by uh altre um so yeah final results so i did do my normal um installation method you know um where i kind of like measure it and lay the baby hair so when i take it off at night i can just throw it on the next day so that's been working out very well and i do actually i i kind of like have started to make the time where i can do that now so i wake up a little bit early just to like put my wig on so i can still feel pretty good today and i'm not rocking my my little uh braids all over the house looking crazy looking like miss silly so i have taken the time to do that for myself um, so yeah, as far as how she's been holding up, so I think I've been wearing her for maybe like four or five days now. So I've had her in for a while and she's starting to get a little ratty on the ends finally, but she still looks really good. She still looks really good. Um, it is getting harder to like comb through her. So I usually brush my wigs out before applying them if I need to. I usually brush, uh, brush them out before I apply them for the day. And this wig, honey, it's like I'm fighting with it. When I first pulled it out of the pack, she was so soft. So, so soft. Like, it's so pretty. It was like a natural shine. It looked like a, it looked like a um, like Nisha type hair texture. And... Okay. This hair dries out so fast. And so, yeah, the front is easy to comb my fingers through. But this, this, this. Oh, my. And it gets worse as you get towards the end. So, so please be aware of that. You know, please be aware of that. Other than that, she's very beautiful. I love this color. Chocolate Frost. Very, very pretty. 
Number four, I think, was 27, hint of 27 in there. Very, very gorgeous. And yeah, I don't really have enough to say about this wig. Um, I think she's a good buy. She's like in the 40 40 ish dollar range. $40 range. Um, it lasts a while. I'm pretty sure I can just wash this um with some fabric softener and it, it she'll bring back like the softness again. So I'm pretty sure there won't be any issue with that. Anyway, tell me what you guys think. If you purchase Adelaide, do you love her? I actually like her, so I will be washing her. I'm gonna try using the fabric softener method to make her more soft and make her more pretty again. And I'll see what I maybe I might, you know, do like an update on either my YouTube or not YouTube, my Instagram or my TikTok. Links will be down in the description box. Thanks for watching.